listening and calling in live from the All Children's Hospital in downtown St. Pete. This is the US 1035 Cares for Kids Radiothon, presented by Dex Imaging. 800 270 8642. Oh, I love those numbers. 800 270 8642. There goes the phone again. Of course, we've got uh, our volunteers here from the uh, All Children's Hospital Guild. And uh, if you uh, do get a busy, try back. We do want to have you become a monthly miracle maker because these phones have been ringing this morning. Put your money where the miracles are. We like it when it rings, right, Kayla? Yeah, tell everybody to call. Uh, <laughs> Say hi. Hi. Say hi, radio people. Hi, radio people. <laughs> Say good morning. Good morning. Hi. Boy, you are cute. Kayla, welcome to the microphone from Jacksonville, Florida. And Eliza, I did say it right, right? Yes. All right. Yes. Yeah, well, good morning. Thank you for coming over and joining us. You're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Don't worry. We're just like, uh, we're like we're just hanging out outside, having a little talk here. Um, boy, look at her now, right? Mm-hmm. She doing well? <laughs> awesome. She's Was, doing awesome. I Wonderful. know. I mean... Mm-hmm. This is a great story, people. Listen close and then call and give with your heart at 800-270-8642. Kayla's first nine months in intensive care. Nine months, think about that. Her first two years on a ventilator for breathing. And her first two and a half years on a trach for eating. Amazing. I mean, just astonishing that, you, that she had to go through that and... Is it what what comes to your mind? What emotions run through you when I just said that? Well, she definitely had a rough time in the beginning of her life, and um, initially, like they had, I mean, we knew that it was repairable. We found out about it when you know through pregnancy, and um, so you knew but, ahead uh, of time. Oh and, yes, and you yes. know what? I should stop you right here. We should talk. You brought some pictures. What was wrong with her? She had a, what you call it, a giant omphalocele. And what that is, is when your org- internal organs mm-hmm. uh, were outside of your body. And, 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 you and some, her, yes, her and you liver. you brought some pictures here, and it is amazing. I mean, it's... Her liver, intestines, and her stomach are all outside in a that. sack. Oh, my gosh. Yes, and... I mean, how rare is this? Well, it, it usually happens every one in 10,000 births per year. And it has an 80% mortality rate. Now, now listen to that, my friend. 80%. Yes. And, and today, look at her now. <laughs> yeah, and, I mean, and, so obviously things have gone good, but these are pretty startling yes. pictures right here. Well, I mean, she, what did you think? She was smaller before, and um, and she was born in Texas. And where she was, they wanted us to wait until she got bigger mm-hmm. because she couldn't handle surgery at sure. that point. That's what uh, they had let us know. But... Um, and then so first nine months was in the uh, NICU and then towards the end, uh, you know, when she got big, so did her organs got bigger just like this. So, so, so then at that to, point, they oh. told us that, he, that she will not make it through surgery. So oh, now you, they say it, it, it's not looking good now. <laughs> and then a concerned oh, nurse had let sorry. us know that we need to find out, you know, seek out help for her so we started doing some research and everything oh and through research we found a surgeon which is four hours away is right. in Houston who has a some experience. Expert, to, right. expert in this because this is really rare mm-hmm. I mean and yes. now you now and your hope has gone back and forth like yes. you said and then you know you know you hear that kind of high mortality rate yes. and you're just thinking your heart is just dropped and it is an expert in doing this who has done um, previous you know Emphalocils and giant emphalocils and had many successes. Mm-hmm. So we went to see him, and that's where and got he got it to uh, be. He wrote a treatment plan for her to right. get it to be reduced the emphalocil to get her ready ready for surgery when it gets small enough. And she didn't so, have it repaired till she was like 21 months. Yes, and in Jacksonville. In, in Jacksonville. Yes, okay. So this is you guys had gone to mm-hmm. Jacksonville, and then you then you and, got connected with all children's here. Uh, yeah, well, how it came about, all children's, we've been um, seeing uh, speech therapists for a long time for feeding, right. and and there wasn't any more progress happening. Uh, we've come to a plateau, and they they got her to a certain point, but I, you know, we weren't going anywhere, and I felt we needed to go to a next level. Right. I've always had hope. There's got to be something else that's going to do. I mean, I'm getting, you know, there's got to be something else. I've always had faith that, you know, 
because she's smart and I know that it will happen. And wow. and when I started talking about all children's, uh, when I talked to them on the phone, and even the staff, they're so wonderful. And, you know, they were able to ask any questions that I had. You know, they were, they were willing to help. I felt like they really care. And I felt connected yeah. that I, I told myself, it's going to happen for me this year, you know, something, something this? is going to happen, um, September, and she turned five years old here, yeah. and, and, and through the intensive feeding program, which she, she went through, and we came in, she was 100% um, too fed, and by the end of the program, she was 100, her fully uh, nutrition is being received by mouth 100% orally. Yeah, this is. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank and, you. I mean, there it is. I mean, that just it, 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 it shows that the miracles do happen. I know you had a start down in, in Texas and then Jacksonville and now here, and this was the, this was it. Mm -hmm. This is the place. And this is why yes, we do what we do because, because success stories about little uh, Kayla here that, that it happens that she was able to become, you know, she's on her way to probably having a normal, yes, happy, uh, healthy, exciting yes. life. And look at her now, she's a cutie. And, yeah, yeah, what do you, what do you, yeah, and, then, yeah. and I'm, I'm grateful for, you know, all children's and the speech therapists and all the therapists in the intensive feeding program. They're very knowledgeable and right. they know what they're doing. And, and, and without this, uh, I, I'm very grateful that now Kayla is able to have a more normal life. Yeah. Because she's you know, had such a, I mean, the first four years of her life, I mean, yeah. she doesn't know, and, no, and you guys and your family are just so worried. I mean, that is incredible. I mean, that, that's really mm -hmm. amazing that, 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 that she has come and, from this. It's, and I'm also thankful for Ronald McDonald House for yeah. letting us to be able to stay here, See? work far, far away, See? you know, and, and yeah. making this possible and for us to be able to do this. Yeah. See, yes. that, that's another great thing that helps the money goes towards that. They get to stay here at the Ronald McDonald House when they do come over here. So, hey, 1-800-270-8642. How about this story with uh, young little Kayla? Yeah, get on board and become a miracle maker right now. $15 a month will put you in that incentive package, lightning uh, package, which is uh, four lower level seats and that signed jersey as well. And uh, it's just great. I mean, the, the future is bright. And yes. uh, for those, just uh, real quick, I, I, talk, I, I, talk to some parents out there that are, you know, that are, uh, you know, they have healthy kids that, that are thinking about donating and maybe they just haven't got around to it yet. Why they should, why they should donate here right now? Well, I think that a lot of people like take things for granted. The fact that you and I are breathing right now and walking, talking, and eating that most people don't realize how important those were just once dreams for us uh, and it's become a reality you know <laughs> and it, it's hard I, I mean it's hard for me to break it out but no you're for, doing great i mean she's overcome so many in the beginning of her life as a such a very young age and our battle and her battle she's has been a fighter all her life and is not over yet because she has a few more things to overcome. She wears a body cast for scoliosis that we have to go to Greenville, South Carolina for, uh, Shriners. And um, the doctor, uh, we had to also research that and it's one of the best, uh, you know, had experience in um, the cast, doing this type of casting. And um, it's amazing. I but mean, you're on it's your incredible. Way. Yeah, then yeah, they're seeing, uh, they're foreseeing a future surgery for her still, too. So, but um, well, yes. our prayers are with you. And, and obviously, this, this place has really been the catalyst. And, and, and it takes a whole uh, whole tribe there. And you've got the other hospitals and experts and, and all that research you've done. It's a, you're I'm a great thankful. mom. And Thank you, it's you. a great inspiration. And I think, you know, like I said, another four or five years, everything will be wrapped up. And hopefully, she'll, like you said, she'll have a normal, happy life. And, and despite all of that, that she's having through so much, she, she's bright. She's very happy, cheerful. Nothing is stopping her. You know, this beautiful little miracle that, it, you yeah. know. Ones <laughs> that, that we have, yes, and I'm thankful for you know my family and uh, friends and for their prayers and support to make us through. All but, right, uh, thank you so much. Yeah, I, I appreciate <laughs> you coming on here and uh, my Kayla pleasure Barnes and Eliza. Thank you guys. You want my to tell pleasure. want to tell everybody to call. Say please call now and donate. <laughs> Good. That's great. Thank you. Thank you All so right. much. All right. 800 270 8642. Do it for Kayla right now. If you were moved by that story, please call Monthly Miracle Maker. Just $15 a month. Put your money where the miracles are at 800 270 8642.
US 103.5 Cares for Kids Radiothon from All Children's, presented by Dex Imaging. Eight square one locations and counting, which means you're 